What's up everybody, it's Zach from Switch Force, brand new Switch game in the house. This is Puyo Puyo Tetris. It has been heralded by a whole lot of people who enjoyed this uh, in the Japanese eShop or maybe even on PlayStation 4. The Japanese version of that came out a long while ago and this game is supposed to be super fun. A puzzler that fuses Puyo Puyo with Tetris. It's releasing both digitally and physically this week. So let's dive in and see what we can make of it. There's an adventure mode, solo arcade, multiplayer arcade, lessons, online play, options, and data. Um, I'm gonna go with the adventure because that seems to be the coolest Thing on the menu. Uh, there's also a whole lot of weird characters, art design, story apparently. So very excited to see what it's this is all about. Day. Ringo welcomes us to the world. So peaceful and quiet. Nothing ever goes wrong on a peaceful day. Hmm. Actually, come to think of it, as great as peace is, it's actually kind of boring. <laughs> It'd be more fun if something exciting happened. Uh oh. Like if all my friends just came bursting out of the sky. Wow, that's a. <laughs> but that's nonsense. Something like that would never happen on such a peaceful day, right? Oh, uh, I'm guessing that's exactly what's gonna happen, Ringo. Huh? Oh my! Oh what's god. Happening? They're all coming out of the sky. I think someone's bursting out of the sky! <laughs> Hey, Carby, looks like we got warped to another dimension. Goo -goo. Oh my goodness gracious, it's a weird fat rabbit with a heart mouth and a diamond nose, ruby, ro ruby nose, carbuncle. Arl? Carbuncle? <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> Told you this story mode got weird. Hiya, Ringo, how's it going? <laughs> hey, Amity, let me guess. You two were in a Puyo Puyo battle, huh? Ooh. And you both popped a whole bunch of Puyos. And suddenly some mysterious power picked you up and sent you here. Just like that! Poof! Goo goo goo! Goo! Long time no see, Ringo. Looks like you're doing well. I feel like this happens to us a little too often. There's no telling where we might end up. That's not such a bad thing, is it? I mean, it brought us to your world, right? Yeah, that's the best part about having Puyo battles. <laughs> I can't argue with that. Well, let's pop some more. We've been reunited, so let's battle! Hold on a second, though. What if, one of these days, we get teleported somewhere scary? Mm. Huh? How can it be scary when we're all there together? Good point. But what if it's somewhere completely preposterous? Yeah? Like where? Oh, I don't know. Um... About the edge of the universe! Whoa. The edge of the who now? Psh, sounds fun to me. <laughs> me too. Let's go. Goo 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 goo. If you guys say so. What was that? I didn't see anything. Um, guys. Oh no! What are all those things falling out of the sky? <laughs> Here comes the attack of the Tetris blocks. So, like, you don't you don't need to deal with all this story stuff. If you don't want to. You can go straight into play, uh, playing the puzzle modes. In fact, from the title screen, you can jump straight into Puyo Puyo or Tetris or the Fusion without even hitting the main menu. So, if you want to avoid all of the cutesy characters and the storyline and the adventure and all that, you can. You can get straight into the puzzle action if that's more your cup of tea. But I think this is the more like interesting and unique aspect of the game, so I wanted to, I wanted to showcase um, kind of what else this package has besides the Puyo Puyo and the Tetris and the Fusion game modes. Is it a new type of Puyo? We just got back from our last adventure! Don't we get a break from all the Puyo Puyo? No, no! Look closer! Goo goo! What are you talking about? Guys, those aren't Puyos! Hey, you're right! There. Blocks? Who oh, just blocks? That's fine. Wait, that's not fine. There shouldn't be blocks. Why are there blocks here? How should I know? They're really coming down all around us, Ringo. There's so many of them. Look, some of them fell into a solid line. It's so pleasing on the eyes. <laughs> oh my gosh, did you see that? The solid line just disappeared. Wait, are 
are you thinking what I'm thinking? I'm trying to put myself in the shoes of these girls. Like, you're getting teleported around. Tetris blocks are falling from the sky. They're disappearing. Very, very odd. Uh oh. Oh wow. I need you, O. Baby. Told you there was a whole bunch of weird characters in this game. T O P P. It's time for a routine report. Pee -pee, pee -pee. <clears throat> Captain's report. This is Captain T of the SS Tetra. I am broadcasting this signal via communications officer O. The constellation zone appears quiet. No ripples in space time to report. End of report. Beep, 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 beep. Hmm. Do we really need to make these reports? I never really questioned them before. Beep, beep. You're right. It's my duty to make a report, even though there's never been any problems out here. It's so peaceful and quiet. Uh oh. Are Puyo Puyo going to be attacking this ship now? Beep. What was that, O? What are the odds? Just as I said, we never have any problems out here. This is not good. Uh oh, oh, it's the girls. They all teleported the ship. You hear that? I heard someone talking inside the playroom. Did you hear, O? Pee pee, pee pee, pee pee. Let's check it out. All right, and now, new background music unlocked. I'm guessing well, that's what BGM is. But more importantly, uh, we get to play now. It's a versus game. Ringo and T. Oh, I'm T. Okay, interesting. Cool. All right, let's see what this is like. This is not good. I got teleported from home, and I'm in some weird place, and I'm all alone. This is so not good. Hmm. Captain's report. A girl in a non-form fitting outfit materialized <laughs> aboard the SS Tetra. I believe she is currently performing an improvised alien comedy routine. Beep, beep, beep. Don't be hasty, yo. Something about this seems not normal. I am unsure what our next course of action should be. Um, <clears throat> you there. Hmm? He's wearing some really tight-fitting clothes. And he's trying to talk to me. Wait, someone sent those squarish things that brought me here. I thought that someone was you. Uh -huh. Sounds like the only solution here is that we should battle. Wait, what? The girl is in a panic. Perhaps a battle might be the best course. I shall fight her until she calms down. Exactly. Beep, 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 beep. Fight them until they calm down. That's one way to handle so, things. <laughs> you know how to match them up and make them disappear too. Of course I do. Are you ready? Let's do this. Tetris time. Ooh. Puyo, Puyo time. It's on. What? She doesn't play Tetris? <laughs> he doesn't play Puyo Puyo, but that's... Oh no, we're starting. Uh-oh. What's going to happen? Our mission is to beat Ringo. We're playing Tetris. She's playing Puyo Puyo. And there are star ratings we can achieve. I like this a lot. I like just like how it's got such a weird vibe to it. Okay. I'm not the best at any of these puzzle games, so uh, please um, forgive me if I am not perfect. I will do my best to uh, make as many wonderful matches as I can. Uh, what's the way to go? Oh, there we go. Okay. Um, all right. So... Again, what's cool about this game is that they allow you to play um, both styles uh, kind of against each other or together. And I don't know, it, it seems really cool. I've never been into Puyo Puyo before. I have played it, a, you know, Tetris throughout the years on different platforms and whatnot. Um, but Puyo Puyo is something I've, I've always thought looked cool, so I'm excited that I get to check it out here. Um, where's the best place to put that? I guess there. Alright, this guy is kind of giving me a hard time. Um. Let's just drop that there. There's what I wanted. That one. Alright. She is not very good at Puyo Puyo. She's having some trouble. And we're starting to work up a little bit of, a, of an appetite here. And we're doing a... A pretty a-okay -okay job. Um, let's throw that there. Another one of those there. This is the one I wanted right there. Right. I'm playing this with the Pro Controller right now. Um, but obviously this would be a fantastic game to take on the go with you. Or play, uh, you know, with the, uh, like, handheld mode. That's what I'm trying to say. All 
All right, we're finally getting a better hang of this. So you're using the face buttons to turn um, turn the, the blocks to Tetrominoes. I think that's what they're called. And then I'm using the up arrow to instantly shoot it down versus uh, the the down arrow, arrow just slowly brings it down. But if you hit the... Uh, if you hit the up arrow, it instantly puts it there. And then I've got that left... Uh, if I use the triggers, I can pull out my piece that's in the hold section, if you see that. So I can grab this here and uh, get that out. And we're really... Her screen is about to fill up and die. She's going to bite the dust. I feel bad about our new visitor to our spaceship beating her so bad right off the, the bat. But it's kind of the way of the world here. Oops, that was a mistake. First mistake. Did not mean to press up on that one. Crap! Um, okay, we're gonna have to work some real magic here. Alright, well, didn't even have to work magic. We took down Ringo in our Tetris board versus her Puyo Puyo board. And see, I only got one star, so you could really improve and get good at this. But, got some credits. Not sure what those are for. Seems like there's a decent amount of stuff to unlock, though. Even though he was using blocks instead of Puyos. And he's not too bad. What were those? I have never seen those jelly things before. Huh? You don't know what a Puyo is? I do not. I have a great deal of questions for you. But first, <laughs> let me introduce myself. I am T, and I am the captain of this vessel, the Starship Tetra. I have the ability to control and clear Tetraminos. Tetrim Tetraminos, that's what they're called, not Tetraminos. Tetraminos. <laughs> So that's what Tetris is. Well, my name is Ringo, and I can pop Puyos to make them disappear. So those round things are Puyos. Uh-huh. And sometimes when we pop them, it sends us off to other worlds. It's a very dangerous game to play, Ringo. It's sort of, kind of, like, well, a portal. Anyhow, I'm sorry for barging in like this. Wasn't on purpose, I swear. But, uh, maybe you can help me? Hmm. It's strange. Now that we've battled, I feel like I can trust you. Really? Me too. Say, T, I was with a few of my friends before I arrived here. There's a chance they were also sent to this ship. They might be just as panicked as I was. Roger, let's go search the SS Tetra together. Thanks, T. Wonderful. All right. New stage unlocked. Now we've got a clear 10 lines within two minutes. So different trials, different verses. This is going to be pretty cool. And there's different acts as well, which I can't access yet. Um, but I kind of like that they, they framed this puzzle game in an interesting, uh, or at least a very uh, upbeat and hyper storyline. So our goal is to clear a whole bunch of lines in just a couple of minutes, which I will do my best to do for you guys. Uh... Like I said, I am not a Tetris pro at all, but I will try my best. All right, we're looking to clear the lines. Eight more lines to clear, and we got a minute 38, so this, sh this should be doable, right? Ugh, that's a yucky block. Guess we'll go there, 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 there. Hmm. No, we're really good to put this one. I guess there. Beautiful. Okay. This is kind of working out. All right. Now we just need a really good one to go down in the edge there. And I'm not going to get one for a while, but hopefully I can survive until then. Um, that was a mistake. No. But we'll be okay. Okay, there's going to be a gap there. There just is. But now, bam. Got a Tetris, which is awesome. All right. Oh, we have that horrible hole in the middle, which is going to screw me up. Oh, no. Um, Let's see if we can make this work. Uh... Okay, I'm running out of time. Oh god. Yeah, I think I screwed this up. No, I got it! Whew! Alright, my noob self managed uh, to make it through with three seconds to go! Uh, Alright, we'll have to see what those credits are for before we're out of here. Alright, now I have to beat Amity, Tetris vs. Puyo Puyo again. Alright, interesting. 
This is the last time I'll ask. S. Simple question. Who are you? What is a Puyo? Are you here alone? Where are your friends? How did you get here? And where are you from? And why are you here? <laughs> and also, are you aware that you're kind of a huge weirdo? Wow. Rude. Ah! My brain hurts. Look, I already told you. Everything was fine. And then I just got whooshed away while popping Puyos. By the way, I'm Amity, and I'm gonna be a great magician one day. A what? Magic schmagic. Look, lady. First, you interrupt my neck. Now, you're just blabbering nonsense. I'm so mad I want to smack you with a tetramino. Wow. <sighs> I hoped we'd find her first. Beep, 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 beep. Ringo. Girl in the red hat, is that one of your friends? Yep, that's Amity. She can be a handful sometimes. And hey, what about that other girl? She seems kind of abusive, don't you think? Oh, that's S. She's one of my crew. And also a handful sometimes. Well, if you're the captain, can't you make her stop? Um, the thing is, you see, uh, well, the, uh, sh short answer is no. No, I can't. Mm. <gasps> wow. Hey, yes. T, finally! We need to talk! What is it? It is the captain's sworn duty to make sure I can nap in peace. And that means we need to detain weirdos before they roam free. Wouldn't you agree? Yes. Did it ever cross your mind? I can't be everywhere! Well, then you're useless! What did you just say? Oh, my! Another person in strange clothes. You're empty, right? Please, try and calm down. You I challenge you to a battle! Oh, goodness. Huh. I guess that's the quickest way to settle this. Bring it! Tetris! Let's battle! All of a sudden, the screams came out. And everyone got serious. We are going to have to beat her. Alright, so since you guys are watching, you kind of get a sense of the two different styles of game. Uh, and they're both similar in the sense that they're like line clearing, uh, color matching type games, but they do have their differences, and it's cool that they're able to fuse them together here in Puyo Puyo Tetris. And uh, because you don't have to worry about the blocks falling, you should be able to get a good sense uh, of the two styles. And then eventually there are modes where they're fused together, which I think is cool. Alright, let's try to keep ourselves alive here as best as we can, clearing some lines. Making some messes, sending some squares. Hmm. Mm, don't like that. Go there. Go there. Yeah. Perfect. That worked out so freaking well for us. At least it seems like it's working out well. There we go. Yes. Beautiful. Alright, Amity is better than uh, Ringo, so we are going to play a little bit a little bit more carefully here. But we should be A-OK. -okay. We should be able to catch a few breaks and win this. As long as I'm careful uh, with my placement. Everything should work out a okay. Beautiful. Yep, we're gonna send her straight to. I was gonna send her straight to the stars. We're in the stars. Can't send her straight to the stars when we're in the stars. Let's save that uh, long block. That long tetramino. That's my favorite one to have. There we go. Yeah, she is building up quickly as we combo our way towards an eventual and almost victory. All right, this is pretty cool, and I can see this being a real addictive uh, portable Switch game. Mm. All right, things are going well. Yeah, she's about to lose. We're about to grab this win. We're very, very close. Again, I wish I was better at this so you guys could have even better gameplay, but I'm doing my best. OK. 
Okay. There we go. Alright, if we can get a nice long blue one, we should be in amazing shape. Right here. Boom, that's a Tetris. Yeah, she's about done. Yeah, buddy. Taking down the Puyo player once again. Good work. Only one star, but hey, we'll take it. What were those blocks? Eh, who cares? Let's do that again. That was fun. You've calmed down a bit. Amity? Hey, Ringo. So glad you're all right. So we can go into the details later, but that boy over there in the ridiculously tight jumpsuit is T. He's going to help us out. That's great. Thanks, T. I love the ridiculously tight jumpsuit. You're welcome. Next up, let's go look for Arl. Is this Arl a friend as well? Oh, she's the bestest there is. Just listen for a goo goo. That means you're close. Um, a goo goo? Did someone say goo goo? I think I heard a goo goo earlier. All right, then let's get a move on. Pippi, pippi, pippi! Oh boy. All right, so we got one last trial that we'll do here. And then I'm gonna move back into the main menu and just see what else we got going on. But I gotta get 1,500 points in a minute 30. So I like the I like how they're mixing the challenges. That's pretty cool. I like that a lot. I'm a fan of that for sure. I just like that the game mixes it up and keeps things uh pretty pretty fresh for the most part. It seems like oh this is gonna be bad. Uh... Okay. Can we keep ourselves alive? Not doing so on the point totals here. But, alright. We'll at least clear our way there. to a few of these. And I think speed is probably better than perfection. There. I think? I'm trying to remember, like, remember when the Facebook Tetris game was, like, really, really popular? I'm trying to remember what people told me uh, back then of, like, what are the goals? The music like makes you feel like you're, you're solving massive world problems, but we cleared it. That's good. Now we're just trying to guess. I guess get a high score, or as high as my little uh, little tetramino body can go. Crap! I did not. So the only complaint I'll say is like I feel like the occasionally I accidentally press up and I do not mean to. I don't know if that's user error or just like. I don't know. Either way, we still completed it, so. Not too shabby. We got our star. And I want to see what these credits do. So you can save replays if you want, but let's uh, quit out of here. We have to beat AI. Tetris versus Tetris. Um, I'm going to back out for now. Um, you can go shopping with credits here. That's what I wanted to see. Now, what the heck do we buy? You can buy different Puyos, new art styles. Interesting. New Tetramino art style. Voice pack, alternate voice packs for the characters. Oh my god, this is my favorite guy. Suka Tudara. Suka Tudara? I don't even know. However you pronounce it, I like that. Alright, so that's kind of cool. I can't buy anything yet. Um, but eventually you can buy different looks. That's pretty cool. I like the fact they got give you the, that flexibility. Um, options, view story scenes, audio replays, play records, and again. There's local multiplayer. Um, we can do it on single screen, which is cool. Up to four players in single screen. Local wireless as well. There's online play. There's lessons to learn all about the different games. And then what I was telling you guys earlier is uh, from the main menu here, you can get straight into Puyo Puyo. So if I want to like, or Tetris or Fusion. So I want to go straight into games real quick on the loads and all of a sudden you're just in playing against CPU. Um, and here we are, which is kind of cool. I like that a lot. So again, you're just like in, which is pretty cool. Um... Made a little chain. Is there a way to make these guys go instantly down? I don't think there is. Up on the D-pad doesn't seem to work for them. But again, yeah, so it's a, it's a real quick in 
to play what you want to play, and you don't have to deal with any of that story stuff, any of the cutscenes if you don't want to. Um, there we go, they're crushing me. Um, but yeah, basically you can go real quick and lose. Anyhow, I'm gonna get to the main menu before I make a fool of myself. That is Puyo Puyo Tetris. That is a good quick look at the game and the, the adventure mode mostly, because I think that's kind of the coolest thing now that it's in English, um, getting that wacko storyline and being able to play through and, and learn about the games and improve so that you can take your talents to the multiplayer arcade or to the online modes. Let us know what you think of Puyo Puyo Tetris in the comments down below. If you plan to pick it up, definitely let us know that as well. It releases this Tuesday digitally and physically. Another good one for the Switch, it seems like filling out that genre uh, list, and now we have a really cool puzzler. So, until next time, everybody, thanks so much for watching. Definitely hit that like button if you enjoyed this Let's Play and videos like this. Make sure to subscribe to stay up to date on the latest and greatest from the Switch and its lineup. And until next time, everybody, thanks so much for watching. Hit that notification bell if you want to see our videos first. For myself, just me, this video, I guess. Just me, Zach. <laughs> Switch Force, out. <laughs>